তেজবে বস্তি আর ত্রিদং জেব বস্তি মাজুদে ফেব্রুয়ারি টেন দে মাতি লাগা ছামলা অপর ওলা আপনি হাঙ্গে ভিউয়ার্স খাঙ্গে দেখায় নাই সে চুল অপর দে আজি ফেব্রুয়ারি থ্রোফ দে রে ডিসি অফিস কমপ্লেক্স চুমুকি দে মাতিবা তাহান ডিস্ট্রিক্ট এডমিনিস্ট্রেশন তেজেব বস্তি ত্রিদং জেব বস্তি ইএনপি আর তেন মে খানে দেখা মিটিং রাখি না সে আই আমি খান যাই না মিটিং লা আউটকাম তো কিনা গা তাই সে হুতাহুতি করে যাব মাতিলা ডিসপুট হলে হাইকোর্ট হাইকোর্ট লাগা ডিসিশন হি মেনটেন থাকি কে আমার কম পারে কোর্টে যাই যাব নাই এটা হলে আমাকে বোধ সাইড বস্তি হলে বি ওয়ার্নিং দিয়ে আছে এনে গান করবি কে ভাল and it was especially unfortunate because there are many people who were interpreting the orders of high court and supreme court in their own way in today's meeting we realized that people were having their own perception about what supreme what honorable supreme court has said and based on that based on this misinformation uh, the passions were rising high and uh, what led to the clash on saturday was highly unfortunate entire incident and the history of it could be divided into two into two larger points what happened on saturday one is the dispute that who to whom the does this land belong to and the second is the law and order part so we address both of them today in the meeting when the meeting started uh, the acrimony was palpable but uh, the sense that we had by the end of the meeting that uh, i think some some reason and some sense has prevailed in people uh, because also we clarified on what the legal position of the matter is what was the decision of the honorable supreme court what was mentioned in the high court so that information asymmetry we could address and we also appeal to the good sense of both the villagers and the tribal hoho leaders were also present we appeal to the good sense of uh, the citizens the village council chairman and the gaon buras and i believe they listen to us i believe they got the sense of it and the time when the meeting was over uh, i think the environment was quite different from where we started well i've asked the police to look into the matter uh, in fact adcp reported that uh, there were some talks and mentions about the firing uh, i have asked the adcp and dcp to look into the matter if uh, some firing has happened it is a very serious issue for us and uh, adequate measures will be taken against it uh, so if in case of any eventuality is the district uh, ready for any eventual eventuality of law and order situation yes of course we are mm-hmm. and that is a point which we have discussed with the police also mm-hmm. uh, however the tribal hohos have assured us and they, that uh, nothing of that sort will happen mm-hmm. and uh, after the meeting especially in fact uh, just before uh, this interview they were here and they have assured us that uh, nothing untoward will happen because the information asymmetry which is there is addressed to quite a bit nevertheless uh, we have given instructions to police also uh, police is also ready as i am reported and uh, i don't think any untoward incident will happen the follow up of today's meeting will be one the tribal hohos will uh, sit with their villages and with their own tribe people and then the two villages will be brought uh, on a discussion see the point is this matter goes back quite long in the first case was probably uh, filed in 1996 uh, so the dispute is from 90s uh, and the technicality of the matter is that the matter is still under sub judice 
so it is in 2009 when honorable supreme court has given the direction they have set aside the ruling of the high court and uh, they had uh, told the high court to take the matter afresh educate on it and where the villagers can go and present their claim so the technicality of the matter is it is subjudiced so there are only two ways one way is that the two party both of the parties go to high court and they get a judgment out of it the second is that these two village realize that they can select their friends but not their neighbors that they should come together they should learn how to coexist they should know that if there is any grievance there is a way there is a mechanism to put forward uh going for vandalism is not a way it is not a civilized way in any which manner and uh, i will repeat what i have told in the meeting also see chumakdima like it is said is the land of opportunity and the development of nagaland will be dependent upon chumakdima's prosperity as well chumakdima will be the growth engine for nagaland and for that to happen the first thing is that peace should prevail now for peace to prevail we need to develop our mechanism how to resolve the conflict i mean forget about multi uh, multiple tribes which are here even with the, in the same community it, it will never happen that for all the times there is uh, no dispute no disharmony but we should learn how to resolve our disputes there will be difference of opinion and the difference of opinion should be uh, should be addressed and should be solved in a civilized manner the discussion should not end people should not go and start vandalizing the shops or whatsoever so that is absolutely not the way f- way forward not a- not only for chumogidema for any place this wo- the violence leads nowhere the violence leads to more violence and even after it is settled it leaves to leads to acrimony it leads a bad taste in the mouth so that is what i had appealed today also and that is what that is something we should learn that how to resolve our differences violence is not the way both parties were asked to maintain the status quo because that is the direction of honorable supreme court also the supreme court has said to maintain the status quo and that that is what uh ec chumokidima had been telling them that is what district administration had been telling them from uh, from earlier in fact there is an entire history of it discuss about 2016 2020 uh, since the matter is subjudice for long so we have told them to maintain the status quo to viewers kan amigan honule parse this is chumokidima abinav shivam is prabhal ba januli dichajila meeting la podiwe ajila meeting the viewers enpu tenni me khan aro tejbe bosti aro trejongje bosti along with the district administration khan meeting rakise tede dc ba bhalwa jani bole dese ja tahan ba duida bosti maju dibi shanti thagi bole kushi aro dc ba ekta jani bole dia do itu disputed jaga kuntu trejongje village aro tejbe village se tadu disputed jaga do tu puras ase kushi aro chilo ga upor de dc ba jani bole dise that to the parties by high court e jaigna aro and get the judgment out of it kushi aro naga korna etu to the busti ba ikilo de milegena ahigena shandiba thagi bolagena jani bole dise etagane mani homonizen updates keep watching global window